Hi guys, my name is Parag Pal and welcome back in our new series of the steel structure design. In this video, I am going to provide you the detailed information of design strength of bolt in which we will discuss bolt in shear. Okay, so I'll explain you what are the formulas you are going to use. This is our lecture number one. Okay, so we'll discuss what are the formulas we are going to use to calculate the design strength of bolt in a shear. Okay, so uh, the nominal shear calculation, I can say here, I can write the formula, the nominal shear strength, okay, of the bolt is given by v n s b okay is equals to in bracket f u upon under root of 3 bracket complete multiply by its n n into a n b plus n s into a s b Okay, so this is a formula guys to identify the nominal shear strength of the board. Now, let's understand every single terminologies to under, uh, to calculate this shear strength of the board. I'm going to do a lots of videos, a full series, detailed concise series of the steel structure from start to end. Okay, so now let's understand what is the ASB. So, if, if you understand the ASB, ASB is the nominal plane shank area of the bolt. Okay. Nominal plane shank area of the bolt. Understand? If you have any doubts, please drop me the comment in the comment section. Okay. The A and B. A and B is the net shear area of the board okay net shear area of the board okay now now this is not at bolt but this is bolt at what at thread understand now f u F U is the ultimate tensile strength of a bolt. Okay. So these are the formulas which as I am explaining today. I am going to provide you a numerical on this formulas and which definitely come in an examination. And only because of that, I am explaining this. Now, N, N, the N, N which is explained here, okay, this terminology is the number of shear planes, okay, number of shear planes with thread, okay, with thread intercepting the shear plane okay the shear plane and after that ns so ns will be the number of number of shear plane without thread Okay, this is a with thread and this is without thread. Okay, so we are considering both for the bolt. Thread intercepting intercepting the shear plane. Okay, now now the concern is guys, this is what we have calculated for the nominal shear strength. Now, when we do want to understand how we can identify the design shear strength of a bolt, for that we do have a different formula. 
so to do the same you you just need to update this formula in your book just maintain one book right so design shear strength of a bolt you need to calculate then that is given by the formula v d s b okay so now remember this formula this formula is very crucial i am going to use this formulas in whole series of the steel structure so vdsb is calculated by whatever the nominal shear you are going to calculate okay so this is vnsb which is we have mentioned above vnsb which is i have mentioned above this formula okay right so this we are going to distribute we are going to divide okay with respect to gamma mb which is having value of 1.25 okay so the formula became fu b fu divided by under root of 3 multiply by nn into anb plus ns into asb divided by the n gamma mb value become 1.25 okay so this is equation number 2 for the design of shear strength okay this is really important video guys if you are missing this video don't miss this this is really one of the very important videos across the youtube channel you won't get this kind of video anywhere okay so so remember if you are watching this video make the proper notes okay and if you do, do required uh, any help please let me know i am happy to help you over there correct so in this class i am stopping here in the next class i am going to bring you the design uh, design of the board in a tension and the design of board in a bearing and after that we'll start doing the calculations okay of the same now you might be asking me what is this gamma mb and everything okay these are the partial safety factors at the multiple stages right so we are going to use this one okay at a certain level and you guys are going to really going to enjoy okay this situations this functions okay so just make sure that you are going to watch it properly and i am i'm def i'm definitely going to tell you this one if you do it properly you will definitely get good benefit across it okay so without wasting time let's see in the next class